song about the uh, UN Sales Convention, the CISG. I wanted to make sure I grabbed that copy before all the other songwriters got it. So, yes, this song is about the, uh, the CISG. It's done from the perspective not of, a, not of a lawyer, but of a merchant. A merchant who's experienced the transition from, from the dark ages before there was a CISG to this commercial paradise that exists now that we have a CISG. <laughs> but it, uh, it does make reference to certain legal issues, and since you don't have written footnotes in front of you, I will, a brief word of explanation will be in order. There are some decisions by several U.S. courts that have uh, improperly declared that uh, when uh, these courts interpret the CISG, they will be guided not by an international perspective, as the CISG requires, but by the provisions of U.S. domestic sales law, which is found in Article 2 of our Uniform Commercial Code, or UCC. Unfortunate, but true. Second, my good friend, Professor Joseph Lukowski of the University of Copenhagen, and I have written a together separately, arguing that the convention does not permit a litigant who has successfully pursued a claim under the convention, does not permit the, uh, such a litigant to recover as damages under the convention the cost of the attorneys employed in litigating that claim. We believe that, it is, uh, that that matter is beyond the scope of the convention and is governed by domestic law, others disagree, but there you have it. And finally, of course, Articles 30, uh, 38 and 39 of the Convention require a buyer to examine delivered goods within as short a period as is practicable and notify the seller of any claimed lack of conformity in the goods within a reasonable time. In determining how long a buyer has to go through this process, there are decisions from certain jurisdictions that shall remain nameless. Well, Germany and Austria, Austria mostly. <laughs> that have in the view of some taken an approach which is overly strict in the amount of time permitted the buyer to go through this process. It's as difficult as it is to believe that German or Austrian courts could be overly strict. So with those ideas in mind, let me perform this song, which I very cleverly call the CISG song. I buy, they're always fine, and my buyers, they never sue. I'm 